Right, so this step is pretty simple here. What we had to do was measure from where we docked our ears all the way down to the bottom to make sure that the cover length matches our blade length. Because I wanted to put it in a tie, I needed to put it in a hem. So where this tie ends up is gonna be right here, right at the very bottom of the sword. So this measurement from the tip all the way down to here is 25 inches. Then I added an extra inch for the hem. So that's 26 inches long that it had to be. Now to figure, figure out where your cover is after you've done the ears, because this takes a little bit away because you're turning it from a two dimensional object into a three dimensional object. It's another reason why I always have a little bit of extra. You're gonna measure underneath one of the ears all the way to the bottom and make sure it's right. If it's right, you're good to go. Put in what you need to. I had the extra at the bottom here so I could do that seam. So now I'm gonna get it dressed.